Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? Oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. Not at <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? Sully? Great. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. believe you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> Recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh, like dead out? Oh, no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan. How the hell are you? Brave. How long has it been? 10 years, 12? 15. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. Oh, <laughs> that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big score. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah, I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but, um, <clears throat> just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. I see. <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. Now, I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe. fight. <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? Nate? God damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this.
God, why did I pick the power room? Ecco fatto. Oh, speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid. Where the hell have you been? I made it. Got a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and there's a right now. He has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing it, remember? What if he calls my bluff? <sighs> he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once, going twice. Scott. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. And for a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. You'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. But now the bid has reached 130,000. <sighs> nope. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. it signore, takes us all the way to 100,000. Gotta be something. Come on. Hey man, uh, starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, Bidding give me a second. 160,000 euros in the room. Signore's bid makes 170,000. Yes. <laughs> We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. <clears throat> Beating has now reached 190,000. Gotcha. My goodness, we are now at 200,000 euros in the room. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's speed, 210,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does, Does the gentleman, gentleman wish to bid again? <laughs> Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice. Then I shall sell it for 500,000. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. 
Barrate tutte le uscite. Nessuno deve lasciarmi Nessuno. Move it, get out of the way. Stop him. Hey, stop that guy. Fermo. What are you doing? You're letting him get away. You speak. Sparisci. Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we've really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. are everywhere. <laughs> okay, maybe we should have brought guns. and get a good vantage point. Merda. Se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. What are we doing, Nathan? I'm on my way. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. There's the ballroom. Driveway's right in front. Okay. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh. Scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. 
You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but uh, I'm afraid I'm spoken for. If you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would... You'd what? <laughs> All right, fine. <clears throat> Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Don't telegraph so much. I'm just trying to make it fair. Nice try. I gave you that one. Freebie. Oh, how sweet. Artifact. All right, look. I have this nice astrolabe back home, slightly used. I'll give it to you for a fair price. <laughs> I have a better idea. All right, look. I'm still a little jet lagged. How about we just call it even? No, I don't think so. Oh, son of a... Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smartass? Well, you know, being a smartass has gotten me this far in life. Why quit now? All right, wait, wait. It's in my back pocket. Where is it? There! All right, I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? Uh, I just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> in there <laughs> I can't get to you from here you got a way down yeah yeah I think so okay I'll meet you at the driveway just head towards the ballroom all right see you there
Aspetta. Cosa hai trovato? Ti troverò. Aspetta. Aspetta. Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good. Jesus! 
I hope I don't go to hell for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good sign. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris. In paradise. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's when Jesus said to Saint Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, you, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but. That means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. 
Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming? Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and a whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Oh, Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. But with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. Things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and... I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me, yeah. No, the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy all those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you, but it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay, I love you too. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth, right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Well, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are gonna have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kid. Happy hunting. Last chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right, we'll see you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah? Just, uh... Ah, uh, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Uh, not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, it'd be a good place to hide. So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. It, I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. Imagine what he want to do to you now. Yeah, <laughs> trying not to. Sam, listen. He's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him. I mean, I've heard stories. Trust me, me too. All the more reason I don't feel bad about any of this. So is it just like you remember it? Of the cathedral grounds? Yeah. yeah. Pretty much. Although it's been so long, it's a little hazy. These crane explosives? <laughs> I think stealing the cross might have made our boy Rafe a little nervous. <laughs> yeah, just a tad. <laughs> 